it turns out that the kind of debilitating effects of climate anxiety are assuaged most effectively, not when we do an action that solves the problem, which is really what you'd think it would be. Mm -hmm. Like, this is a problem that can't be solved by any one person's action, so why should I even do anything? That's what most young people feel, right? Like, I'm not even going to try. That particular assumption rests on the idea that if we did the action, our climate anxiety would be assuaged by fixing it. It turns out that the psychologists who have studied this show that this is not true. And the act of being in a group is actually the thing that alleviates anxiety and makes us feel efficacious, which is really an interesting and important tool, especially, I think, in a culture that's so individualistic. So Bill McKibben is sort of famous for saying, you know, people constantly ask me all the time, you know, what's the most one most important effective thing I can do as an individual? He always says the one most important thing you can do is not be an individual, you huh. know, not think of individualism as the mechanism by which this is going to get accomplished. And it turns out from a psychology perspective, it's not just good for the planet. That's actually good for our mental health. 